So you all really wanted to see my car because I obviously got a new car and uh, I did promise I'll make a small video on it. So what I've done is I've made a really short video on it. Um, I'll show you it around and we'll go for a little drive. But I'll do a proper like Top Gear one once I'm back after this Valentine's weekend because we're going down to London. Uh, if you want to see me vlog that, guys, tell me in the comments down below. But uh, yeah, so let's go outside. Uh, actually, it's going to be daytime when we go outside because I'll do this tomorrow. But we're going to go outside and have a look at the new car. So everybody, if you follow me on Instagram and Twitter, you know I have a new car. And obviously from this title of the video, you know I have have a new car uh, and I'm gonna show it to you guys today this has been my dream car since I can ever uh, remember I think it came out and uh, the first time I saw it was on that film I robot with Will Smith uh, and it is amazing so I got this the other day I still have my green BMW but I'm getting rid of it sadly uh, I was hoping Charlotte would want it so that she could have it but she doesn't like well she likes it but she doesn't like being out in a bright green car as you can understand so instead I got myself this beauty dun 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 look at this Look at it. It is an Audi R8. It's a V8 model because I can't get insured on a V10 model, like nowhere near. Uh, and I, luckily I can get insured on this. I have no idea how I can get insured on this. Uh, but as you can see, it is silver. It has got the carbon fiber pack. If you knew your stuff, that is uh, this basically uh, is all carbon fiber on the side. And it's got carbon fiber on the inside. But the best thing about this car, guys, is this. That is the best thing about this car so from the rear of the car let me just stand back a bit you can actually see the engine it's completely lit up as well at night but you can see it down there uh, and it's a beaut so it is a two-seater car and the engine is uh, in the rear of the car as you can see um, i'll take you on an inside tour in a second but there you go you can have a quick little brief look in there uh, it's all very black and very leathery because i like black and i like leather um, but I'll take you around the back as well. It's got the quad exhausts on it. Uh, I think it's pushing 420 brake horsepower, not 60 in 4.5 seconds. Um, it's got the nice fins on the back as well. It makes the booty look super nice. Uh, the spoiler actually comes up and goes down. I think it goes up at 60 or 70 miles an hour, but I can you can set it so it's up. But I think it looks really cool when it's up. Uh, you've got 19 inch alloys on the side here. And again, across from the carbon fat and from the front, this car just looks so aggressive. It's just a thing of absolute beauty. Look at it, it's amazing. So it's got full LED headlights as well, so it shines up really nicely. And overall, it's just an amazing car. So let me take you inside. I even noticed today, you see these? That says R8 on it. So I don't know if down the road, it's gonna like brightly say R8, but I'm not quite sure what that's for. Uh, but we're gonna have to find out. So let's get inside and have a look in it. Right, so we've got some music on at the moment, so let's turn that off. Um, so this does have the multimedia pack, so it's like a better sound system, I think. Uh, and inside it, you can see from the back, you can actually see over into the engine. So you can see over into the engine bay there. Uh, Two-seater, like I said, and there's like no luggage. Oh, the funniest thing, actually, before we get into this, is I'll show you the boot, right? Obviously, most cars' boots are in the back, but because we have an engine in the back of ours, our boot is actually in the front of the car. And you pop it open... And there it is, there's the boot. How cool is that? It's actually not a bad size. Uh, and underneath this, I think you have like, yeah, like hazard stuff, just in case you need to kill somebody or save yourself if you're dying. I can't remember, it's one or the other, but uh, yeah, that's the boot. And um, that is like that. Anyway, let's get back inside. It's actually really, really cold today. So this was probably a bad day to do this. Uh, let's get inside. Ooh. Oh, it's nicer in here. So in here, uh, it is quite cozy. It's actually, it's roomy, but it's quite cozy, especially since I have huge feet. Uh, it's pretty bad for my feet because it's hard to get into all the pedals, but that's not a problem. It's a manual, as you can see, a six speed uh, manual. You've got here, this is for mag ride. So that's basically sport mode. This is to do the spoiler. So I don't know if it will work while I'm stationary, but no, it doesn't. All right, uh, it would put the spoiler down, but because we're stationary, it doesn't. Hazard, ESP, parking sensors, heated seats, uh, aircon, blah, 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 blah. The sound system and kind of navigation system all there, all built in nicely, which is cool. And uh, yeah, so let's start this baby up. You can also see, because I got the carbon pack, all of this is like carbon fiber all around the sides here, which is really nice. Uh, but let's get inside it. Let's shut the door. <laughs> Welcome to my car. And let's start it up. 
Oh, it's so nice. I like, I haven't had a V8. My family have V8s. I haven't had a V8 yet. And this is my first V8 and it is just so nice. We literally just, as I was driving to film this video, we just hit 25,000 miles on it. I don't know if you can see that. So we just hit 25,000 miles on the clock. We are going zero miles an hour at the moment. Um, but yeah, so let's take it for a spin. I'll hopefully try and get some cool shots of it. It's actually quite hard to get shots of the car, uh, but I'll try and get one of the engine bay as well. And uh, yeah, let's just go for a drive. Wait, wait, who told you I move like Paul? I see my drive in a German wait, wait. 